Apple Original Films has announced plans for a sequel to the John Watts-directed drama Wolves, starring George Clooney and Brad Pitt. This development comes as the film, which will make its world premiere at the 81st Venice Film Festival, pivots to a limited theatrical release on September 20th, followed by a global debut on Apple TV Plus on September 27. The decision to alter the release strategy for Wolves was confirmed by Apple, although it does not indicate a change in their broader hybrid strategy. The company will continue to employ a streaming service release preceded by a wide theatrical release for other films, such as the Formula One drama F1, starring Pitt and directed by Joseph Kaczynski. This approach was also used for recent releases like Killers of the Flower Moon and Napoleon. In Wolves, Clooney plays a professional fixer hired to cover up a high-profile crime. When a second fixer, portrayed by Pitt, arrives, the two must navigate an increasingly chaotic situation. The cast also includes Amy Ryan, Austin Abrams, Porna Jagannathan, Richard Kind, and Zlatko Burek. The film is produced in partnership with Clooney's Smokehouse Pictures and Pitt's Plan B Entertainment, John Watts, known for his work on the Spider-Man Homecoming trilogy, directs and produces Wolves. He collaborates with producers Diane McDonagall, Clooney's Smokehouse partner Grant Heslov, and Pitt's Plan B partners Dee Dee Gardner and Jeremy Kleiner. Apple's head of features, Matt Dentler, praised the film, stating, with George and Brad's remarkable and engaging chemistry under John Watt's extraordinary direction, Wolf's blends all the great elements of comedy, action, and drama into a hugely entertaining movie that will leave audiences ready for what's next. This strategic move aims to maximize audience reach for the star-driven film. Apple's recent release, Fly Me to the Moon, did not perform well theatrically despite its star-studded cast, influencing this decision. The company plans to adapt its release strategies based on marketplace performance, with future films like Steve McQueen's World War II drama Blitz also receiving limited theatrical releases.